Hello everyone, welcome to this channel. Today is February 20th, 2023. The Lord titled this word, The Fog of War. And the scripture he gave me is one that I'm sure is very familiar to everyone. Matthew 24, verses 6 through 10. And you shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that ye not be troubled, for all these things must come to pass but the end is not yet. For nation shall rise against nation, and kingdom against kingdom, and there shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes in divers places. All these are the beginning of sorrows. Then shall they deliver you up to be afflicted, and shall kill you. And ye shall be hated of all nations for my name's sake. And then shall many be offended, and shall betray one another, and shall hate one another. And this is the word. <clears throat> my son, war is at the door, yet my body is blind to it. The fog of war has them blinded, and yet the battles have yet to rage. The foreign armies stand ready to attack. Their generals stand ready to command, and yet the nation whose eyes are only on self, is not ready. The bloodshed will be great. Streets will be filled with the blood of a people whose unrepentant hearts fail to recognize that this is judgment for the sins against a holy God. My son, very few of my children even believe that the time spoken of in my word is upon them. My children still expect the nation of America to correct its course and become a holy nation by electing the right person into office. But I say now, as I have said before, judgment on America is set. No amount of prayer will stay my hand. America, your sins are like the flesh-eating virus eating away at your body. My body in America is blind to the sin in my house. Many of my children have taken poison into their bodies and are dying. Many in my body see my word as archaic and old-fashioned and needs to change with the times. My body thinks that you can live and love in sin, and I will turn my back and wink my eye. Repent now. Turn from your evil ways. You pollute the temple of the Holy Spirit and see no wrong or sin in it. Repent now. My son, soon war will rage across America and no one except my remnant will be ready to stave off the fog of war. So bloody will this time be that all other wars will pale in comparison. Those that survive will become captives of armies that I have sent. Why, you ask? The only way to break a stubborn horse is to ride it to defeat. My children will turn to me when I am is all that they will have. America, you are that stubborn horse, and I am going to break you, whether you like it or not. I was with Moses when I broke Israel. I was with Daniel, Jeremiah, and Ezekiel when I broke Nebuchadnezzar. And I will be with you, my children, through the fog of war when I break America. I love you. War is at the door. Prepare now. Stay in my word. Stay in prayer. Amen. Given by the Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for subscribing to this channel. Please like and share if led by the Lord to do so. Please see the description box for the transcript of this word. If there's anyone out there who has not come to the Lord Jesus, repent, ask for forgiveness, and surrender your life to him. Time is short. Thank you, and God bless you. Bye for now.